Could this giant telescope help protect the Earth from asteroid threats? This is one of the world's biggest telescopes, twinned with the world's biggest camera, about to embark on a 10-year mission to see everything that goes whiz, flash, bang in the night. Using the largest camera ever built, the Vera C. Rubin Observatory in Chile will spend the next decade creating an ultra-high-definition map of the night sky. And according to space scientists, it could transform our understanding of the universe. Located on the Cerro Pachon, a mountain in the Coquimbo region of Chile, the Rubin Observatory boasts superlight sensitivity, the widest angle lens capable of capturing a huge swathe of the sky and the fastest moving mount for a telescope this size. These features enable the observatory to scan the night sky with unprecedented speed and detail, creating a time-lapse that can spot movement or differences in brightness in faraway galaxies. Here is Professor Catherine Haymans, Astronomer Royal for Scotland. When we first started thinking about how, how would you build the ultimate telescope for astronomy that could look at absolutely everything from what's going on inside our solar system to what's going on out in the universe billions and billions of light years away. And to do that, you need a really, really big, te big telescope, which is exactly what they've built, plus a really wide camera that allows us to map the entire uh, visible sky every three to four days. Its mission includes mapping out all the asteroids in our universe, tracking their path, trajectory, and potentially identifying any on a direct collision course. Um, astronomers and space scientists are working on how to deflect things if an asteroid is, is coming in our direction, but it's going to be the Rubin Observatory that spots it because it can see things that are moving across the night sky. The Legacy Survey of Space and Time Project is funded by the US National Science Foundation and the US Department of Energy. The data produced will be analysed in Scotland, France and the US. It will also be made available to scientists around the world and will help answer fundamental questions about astronomy. Including what's going on on the dark side of our universe, the mysterious dark matter and dark energy that seems to make up the majority of, of everything that's out there. 